I'm Natalia Bonner. It's day 212. Today we're going to be stitching using my 4-in-1 machine quilting ruler. Now I just want to take a second and remind you that my brand new class, Let's Stitch Scallop Borders, starts on January 1st. This class is on sale for just $35 until January 1st. So hop over to my website, peaceandquilt.com, and check out that class. It's going to be so much fun. But in the meantime, let's get stitching. I'll start out by using my blue Mark Beyond marker and marking a T through the center of my block. After I've marked my T, then I've measured in a quarter of an inch from all four sides and made a marking there. I'll begin stitching in the center of my block. From the center of the block, I'll stitch a curved line. You can go in any direction out to that marked point. Then I'll adjust my ruler and stitch back to where I began stitching. Once I've stitched one petal, then I'll move on and repeat this on all four of those lines, coming back to the center point every time. Now that I'm at that center point, I'm going to stitch out along that marked line, moving out about halfway through the block, then back to the center point. I'll repeat this process on all four sides of the block, adding that fun little vein to the inside. Now I'll travel along my previous stitch line, moving out to add an echo stitch around the outside of this block. You will notice that I will adjust my ruler slightly as I'm stitching to create a nice, even, and consistent echo all the way around the outside of each of these blocks. After I've stitched that echo all the way around, then I'll finish off this design by stitching in the ditch around the outside of the block and spritzing away those marked lines. I hope you enjoyed today's block and found a little bit of inspiration with my machine quilting. Now just remember, you can pick up the panel, the rulers, the thread, all of the notions that I'm using in this video today over on my website, peaceandquilt.com. And don't forget to share your progress pictures over on Instagram using the hashtag Let's Stitch with Natalia. That's where we will be selecting winners for weekly prizes. See you all tomorrow.